I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars, Gemini. Now, there's a couple of things happening this week which are noteworthy, and particularly your ruling planet, which is in your solar second house. In, in fact, most of the activity is happening in this area of your chart. So let's talk about, first of all, what that relates to. So your second house is, governs money, possessions, when it's love, um, uh, love as well. And so when it's a do of love, you have to be a little bit careful about not being possessive. Certainly, you're an independent person, Gemini, but you like to be connected as well. But you have to be a little careful about being possessive, possessive in this area. And also, uh, Venus is in this area of your chart as well for most of the week. So that's sort of a, a warning there. Now, um, Jupiter is going to transit out of your sign. You've had it there for about a year, and it's transiting into the next in, into the next sign, your solar second house. Um, this is also to do with how you value yourself as well. Okay, and Jupiter is all about abundance and expansion. So the more you value yourself, it's very important to really get a high self esteem because the more you value yourself with this transit with Jupiter in your second house, the more you can attract it to yourself okay all okay, right now small word of warning uh, mercury your ruling planet is going retrograde on the 26th as well same day so um, you're going to have to just be a little bit careful about what you do how you do it particularly with your communication double check that it's gone across in the way that you want it to be heard okay have a great week i'm jennifer angel thanks for watching